Hi, let me today tell you a strange story from my life. One day I was studying in the university and I was staying in a block behind the university outside the complex of the university and unfortunately at that location we did not have shops nor restaurants and in order for us to buy something we have to go through the university and go to the markets and shops and come back through the university to my apartment one day i was coming back to my apartment at night and i found a girl carrying a box on her way to the other block of the university from far away i could see that the book looks very heavy because of the way she was carrying it when i reached that girl i said hi can i please help you to carry the the box could you please put it down so that i can help you to carry the box she said um, who are you i told them about myself where are you staying i told her i'm staying nearby here i'm staying in nearby that that block of the university uh, she said it's okay i can carry i told her no way you can carry this box this box is very heavy on you please uh, just put it on the ground and i will lift it up i lifted the box up and i went back through the university and when i reached the other block of the university i told her i'm actually staying in another block outside the university i told her like that because i was afraid that when she knows that i am an outsider i'm not staying inside the complex of, of the university she would be afraid of me so i told her i'm staying nearby just to make her more comfortable with me when we reach the buildings I am staying in, I first asked her about, about her level, gave her the box, and this is my phone number if you need help, because she was about to move her stuff from the university uh, hostel to the new apartment. So I gave her my phone number, and I gave her my address. I told her I'm staying here just a few level uh, below you, and if you need help, kindly contact me. But nowadays I'm having an internship and i go in early in the morning and when i come back i will be ready to help you to move your stuff because she told me i don't have friends i don't have someone to help me that's why i felt sorry i felt sorry that she is alone when i used to reach the university because i used to go with the university bus the university bus used to arrive at the university i i used to contact her i am already in the university if you need my help kindly just reply to my message she replied and i booked a car for her and i moved a bunch of big stuff to the other building and I paid of course I paid to the taxi the other day I did the same thing and I booked again and we carried the rest of the stuff I swear the last day when I moved all the stuff I carried all the stuff myself I did not allow her to carry anything I moved all the stuff to her apartment then I went back she never called me back again this is just one part of my life and this is how I used to help others I used to help them without them asking me for help that's only one part of hundreds I'm not kidding hundreds of stories like this and more I used to carry I used to help without them asking me for help but no appreciation what was strange to me is that no thank you nothing she did not give me anything she did not even reply to my messages and that's a strange act of course i continued to be the same human even though most of them did not appreciate my kindness i continued to be who i am because i know that there is god and whatever i do will never go away it will have a good impact in my life in the future hopefully Thank you very much for watching the story.